Hey guys, I hope you guys are having a great day enjoying yourselves out there. I'm super excited about this product that I'm about to review today. I've been looking for it for about three years. Been looking to get my hands on one for about three years and I wanted one so bad and I got myself one. And the product in question is the SodaStream Jet, the BPA free, free version of course. And we're going to get into the unboxing and the review of this product and show you exactly what this entails. So let's get into it guys, all right? Okay guys, as you can see here, um, I'm actually at my coffee bar, which is exactly where I'm gonna be placing this. I made a video and if you're a subscriber of this channel, which you should subscribe to this channel, there's a video of VPA free coffee bar appliances that I actually made a while back i'll leave the link of that video in the description below as well so you guys can check it out i might even link it in the end screen so you guys could check it out as well to make it easier for you guys but it's not about that today is about the soda stream jet i'm excited to unbox this thing i'm super excited i've been trying to get my hands on this thing for so long and i'm so happy about it i get to make my own sparkling water my own soda if i want to without having to consume any soda with chemicals in it in any way, shape or form. And that to me is priceless. So now let's get into the opening the box and putting the, pulling the appliances out and getting it running. All right guys, so let's get this. So. Mm. Man, oh man, super excited. plastic and that's the appliance in itself with the bottle in it it's cool and inside there is the canister that's the appliance in itself with the bottle in it and now I'm gonna actually get the book there we go the user guide And that's all that's in the box. Dispose of the box. Okay, there's one more piece of thing there. Oh. Yep, that's the bottle cap. All right. So, as you can see, there's no electrical wires that goes in the back of this whatsoever so all you do is push this button and it puts co2 carbon into your water and which you can consume as salsa water or you can make soda based on the flavors that you like and all of that stuff so that's how cool this item is So to look at it, in order to open it, there's actually two buttons on each side. You squeeze each of these buttons, and that's how the back opens. And in order for you to put it completely together, you have to open this, I believe. There it is. There's the little tab thingy. You gotta get rid of this blue plastic. And now the canister is almost ready to be used. And just like that, once you untap it, the canister is ready to be used. And I think you place it in here. And up there, so I think that's how it goes. Could be wrong. Oh no, it goes at the bottom of it. There we go, just like so. And that 
that's how that works. And now, in order to do it, you got to close it up this way. For some reason, the top is closing, the bottom is not snug. So let's figure this out. There we go. bottle that's how you do it and that's how the bottle looks everything's perfect it has the BPA free signs on there and what temperatures to store it as and it's completely recyclable the bottle itself is completely recyclable and if you want you can go on Amazon and buy some extra water bottles, which is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna buy some extra BPA free bottles so I can actually have more um, seltzer water or sodas available to me as needed. And you can remove this bottom piece if you put spilled water in there to trash the water. And that's pretty much that. So now we're gonna get into getting it to work all right guys so i was able to rinse the water bottle off and put fresh water in it fresh clean purified water of course and that's how you use it you want to make sure you twist the cap off and now it's flat and another for you to carbonate you just go like so and it carbonates the water and just like that you have carbonated water or seltzer water to say the least and now we're good And keep in mind that's just regular H2O, regular carbonated H2O to say the least. I'm gonna actually get a cup to try this out. So this is it guys, um, pouring it in a cup and I'm gonna consume it and I'm gonna tell you exactly what I think of it. That's the water in question. And let's get to it. Gonna get into drinking some quality H2O. All right, guys, this is the glass I just poured for myself and I'm gonna take a swig of it and see what, I, what it tastes like. So let's get to it. Cheers. Very good, tastes very good. I have no aftertaste whatsoever considering that it's quality H2O but it's obviously bubbles so it's great I will be doing a video probably a month or two later as I learn more recipes on how to make different sodas and different flavored um, seltzer water with the Soda Stream Jet be on the lookout for that enjoy this guys have a good one cheers Hey guys, thank you so much for watching the video all the way to its entirety. Appreciate it very much. My channel, Stanley's Review, has a goal as of the end of this year to reach 5,000 subscribers. And this is where you guys come in. I'd love you for you guys to subscribe and also like and comment on some of our videos as well. Check out our channel and interact with us. Let us know exactly what kind of videos you want us to make, what kind of review videos you want us to make. That would be greatly appreciated. Any suggestions that you guys can give, that would be awesomely uh, appreciated. And I'd be more than happy to interact with you in regards to these matters as well. Enjoy, guys. Have a great day. Peace.